when I lace my shoes to go running. I prepare myself to enter into a world of unknown. When I run, I feel in control. Until my muscles start to burn from the lactic acid that was produced because I cannot breathe. That's when running becomes fun. Embarking on such a journey it taxes your ability to endure pain and dangerous terrain. Whether a four minute mile, a 400 mile six day journey, the steps add up one by one. Patience and long suffering help me overcome the voices in my head that say quit, you're not good enough. To quote Frank Abagnale Sr. off of Catch Me If You Can, Two mice fell in a bucket of cream. One quickly gave up and drowned in the cream. The other one worked so hard that he turned that cream into butter. Their starting point was the same. And how one handled the shock of falling into the bucket, understanding its surroundings, the difficulty of surviving, striving to reach the end, and crawling out changed their lives. I believe myself to be the second mouse. Running as an art form is a journey in itself. Every time I unlace my shoes at the end of a run, I look back and always think I did something. Sometimes I'm in extreme pain and other times an extreme high. It has been a gift to go through hundreds of journeys. Each run is unique, each run is special. It made you humble or you were totally extremely disappointed in your performance. The journey teaches you something. And when I throw my shoes onto the ground because I'm happy to stop, or I'm not happy, I benefit from running. Yeah, I think that's the end. Did any of that sound good? Yeah. <clears throat> Heck yeah.